Hey guys, it's Zachary here, and I'm back after a little while. I'm. It's been a bit with the whole thing with Bella, but we're not gonna talk about that today. We're gonna talk about more important measures, like what's gonna happen right now. In case you don't know, I'm moving, which means I cannot film ZNRS. One, because I don't have the time, and two, because I don't have the Bristol track I need. And there's a bunch of cardboard boxes out there with all our stuff, and I need that to make the track. My mom won't let me buy more cardboard or poster board or anything to make tracks out of. And I don't want to do what I did with Eldora anymore. Because I'm better than that now. <laughs> so, what we're going to be doing is we got a bit of a, um, a predicament. I've got some ideas that I was thinking of. Let me show you. Then we're going to go on to um, customs. I don't know if it's going to pick up good, but I've got a bunch of 20, 10, 11, 12 die casts in one 2015 Dell Jr. But that's because I can't find a 2012 one. To make me make a 2012, like, race for once. Just like a quick off race. I also got two new expandy cars, if I can can the well. There's the two expandies. So, I've got that. But I'm probably not going to do that either. I may do that after season two of ZNRS. But what I also got, I got some of them in the bag right now. Look at it. Look at it. Look at it. <laughs> yeah, I bought tons of the FNAF action. I bought every single one of the FNAF 6 action figures. Oh. Oh. Um. It appears the parrot wants to leave, but. Yeah, I've got every single one of the FNAF 6 action figures. They're even built up. All the way built up Scrap Baby. She fully is built up, even though she's broken. I have to hot glue her back together, and I got L Chip. And pick patch. I've only got them in there because I took them on traveling. I've also got a broken broken circus baby. Here I found a Walgreens if you can see. I had to hot glue her arm to make it stay because the plastic plastic joint broke. And this one is about to break. So I probably won't use her for anything. It's kind of hard to get to focus. So I've kind of gone in on the FNAF merch. That's not even it. I've got three mystery minis. Two of the FNAF 6 Mystery Maze, Rockstar Freddy and Healthy. And I've also got this Black Light Golden Freddy. So I've got way too much um, FNAF stuff. So I'm thinking of making a FNAF 6 action figure stop motion series with the, um, the, with the figures I have. I know it's just feeding into the FNAF craze, but I actually really like FNAF. Not just because everybody likes it. I actually really enjoy playing the games. Even though I'm not very good at them, but. And we're gonna do one last thing before we go. We're gonna show you my customs I've made over the past little bit. So currently we've got a work in progress. It's Brad Kozlowski's number two snap on Ford Mustang. So I can have a Mustang Kozlowski. Still gotta put on the, um, the sides, but other than that, that one's all most ready. Oh, and I also got a nail polish here. Um, um, yeah, we'll go with this one first. So, I went ahead and I attempted to fix my Matt Benedetto. You know, we're going to take this with me because that way I can show you better. But I tried to fix Matt Benedetto. Still made the template too small, but I feel like it looks a lot better now. So, now I feel confident in that one. Jimmy Johnson Lowe's for Pros Chevrolet Camaro. I'll be running this at the Bristol race. Gotta remember, most of these templates come from NASCAR Funk Builders Cup Series. He'll be featured a bit later in the video for reasons. But we got Kyle Larson's Credit One Bank. I felt like I had to make a Credit One Bank car. Hoping everything's not like flipped because it is from what I see. Then I got some Suarez die cast. First, we got his Haas Automation car. I still got a Gotta like sharpie and some black where it doesn't quite reach it. Now this one, which actually went over my old Kurt Bush 41, it's his Eris car. It's not actually his Eris car, but it's close enough. Okay, I gotta sit down on camera for a second. So I just gotta get through my collection. There's so many. Okay, I was thinking about taking Chris Busher out of series and putting a new driver in, but because I, I didn't like the template, but I've actually found a good template. 
This is another NASCAR Funk Builders Cup Series template. I use a lot of his templates to make 2019 stuff because I'm cheap and I don't want to pre-order the new stuff. So I just take my old stuff and just mm, NASCAR work. Except for the Kozlowski, the Suarez, Suarez Haas, and then this one, a David Reagan A and W car. Which he'll be making his debut at Bristol to make out actually a full even field, which will make some people happy. Let's go ahead and jump to Paul Menard. No, I didn't make a whole new Paul Menard car because I'm lazy, but I did go ahead and print out the Ford Mustang front and back ends to make it that, that happen. So we got that. Let's see what else? Okay. Ryan Blaney, a first Ford Mustang. I got all Penske Ford Mustangs now. Money Lion um, Blaney diecast. Another one of his Instagram ones. He's posted a lot of Instagram ones, and a lot of them I end up making into templates. Now we got the last one that's not made by NASCAR Funk Builders, and that is a Daniel Hemrick number eight. Whatever that sponsor is, car. And then finally. If I can get the, this is the problem with having a collection that this that's this gosh dang big. It's hard to find anything. <laughs> okay, there we go. Sorry for terrible cameraing, but finally we got Ryan Newman's number six Acorn Chevrolet, not Chevrolet Ford Mustang. Sorry. And I really am running out of cars to do templates on, so I'm running out of 2019s, and I want to make a whole Arca series. Well, I guess I can show you off this one, which is an actual diecast of action bought with my own actual money. Because now, as you can see, I got like shelves of diecasts now. But here in the Chase Elliott collection, I got Chase Elliott's number 2018 Little Caesars car. Bought this car because I knew the 2019 would take 15 million years to show up. So I've decided just to buy the 2018. And that means I've got every single paint scheme Chase Elliott has ever won in. His Synergy Blue, his Mountain Dew, and his Napa. I've got all of them. And if you can see from my um, from this, I don't have very many cars to make templates out of anymore. That one I can't because it's a championship car, and neither can I do that one or that one really. But a lot. But I can do the rest of these, and then that's it. I've run out of cars to make templates. But one car that's super important to me that I made was the Bella Number no. Seven. It's not a very good templated car, I'll give it that, I'll give you that, but it's sentimental for me, it's big, it's big importance for me. Being which, let's go find Bella, because I want to show to you, because there's been some cases of people saying that they thought Bella was dead, and we're going to go find Bella. She's probably laying downstairs like she always is. Let's find out. Nope, she's outside. <laughs> Well, then, let's not disturb her while she's outside, but she's fine. Medication's keeping her drugged up. She's not okay, but she's definitely drugged. So the main question I have is, do you want to do a 2012 season, or would you like a FNAF thing? I'm going to do both of them eventually. Just which one do we want me to focus on first? But um, anyway, that is it for this video. As I set back up the camera, now I'm too far away. All right. Well, that is it for this video, guys. Hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time. Bye!